Shout out Runjavi Log if you like entertainment and comedy videos then check out this channel link in description. Hello fish lover. Welcome to my new video. Today we gonna talk about Rost man-made fish. With so many amazing fish to choose from. Why try and create our own? But unfortunately there are plenty of man-made fish out there. Please don't buy this types of fish. And. Breeders also don't breed this types of fish. This types of fish looking so attractive but they are struggling to live. And highly chance they will die faster than other fish. I am not saying all man-made fish are rost. There are some great man-made fish also available. Here's our top 10 of some of the worst. Number 1. Glow in the dark fish. We're all up for science having genuine benefits to health. But put it in the wrong hands and useful gene technology can quickly become the next cosmetic. Money maker. Introducing the glow in the dark angel fish and hot off the backs of the fluorescent zebra danios and rice fish, called glawfish, which glow under black light. They look so beautiful but there are die faster and more effective their health. Number 2. Bubble eye goldfish. One of the worst fish on this list is also one of the most long standing, the bubble eye. Those huge, fluid filled sacs affect swimming ability most of all, but also eyesight, and are a risk to the fish's health if they get caught, torn, or popped and then become infected. Add large bubbles to a missing dorsal fin, large, twin tail, and centuries of line breeding, weakening the fish, and you get a very unlucky goldfish. They are struggling to live and highly chance to blast their bubble. If you are love goldfish so please don't buy bubble eyes goldfish. Dot there are so many beautiful goldfish to keep and my first fish is also goldfish. They are so beautiful and easy to care but don't buy bubble eyes number 3. Parrot cichlid. Okay, so the parrot cichlid is a hybrid of at least two species. The severum and mita cichlid. Only they have then been selected for the balloon, short bodied form and have deformed mouths. Then add on injection of dyes, tattooing, and even tail docking to form hard parrots and you have another victim of man's strange, cruel ways. Please don't buy tattoo parrot cichlid. Number 4. Longfin Serpay Tetra. What's the definition of irony? A fin nipping fish that nips its own fins perhaps? Longfin fish are long. Established and very popular. Like male guppies and Siamese fighters for example, but they don't nip fins. Line breed a known fin nipping species like the Serpe tetra to have long fins and when you keep a group of them, like you should with all tetras, they bite each other's fins. Number 5. Long fin koi. Tell a proper koi keeper that you like long fin koi carp and he or she will look at you like you have just insulted their own mother. To the purists the long fin koi is an abomination and we have to say we are inclined to agree. All that size, power, grace, and elegance while swimming reduced to an awkward waddle. Number 6. Two-headed Arauna. Are these Siamese twins man-made? We would argue that they are, as they were produced in an Arauna farm. Albeit as a freak occurrence in a spawning. Instead of being spat out in the normal way by the parent though, which in the wild would mean deformed fry spiraling down to the river bottom where they would be eaten, this two-headed arauna was hand-stripped, and artificially reared. Number 7. Flower Horn. Another poor victim of cross-breeding for cosmetic and financial gain, the hybrid. Flower Horn cichlid originated from crossing the Trimac cichlid with a whole host of other Central American cichlid species and seeing what came out. Some were more colorful versions of Trimax with better patterning but still all the attitude, while others develop larger nuchal humps. About a decade on those humps are getting seriously large, too large, and short-bodied fish are also being favored, which are missing vertebrae, but the unluckiest of all get their tails chopped off with no anesthetic. The Chinese call them lucky but a modern flower horn may be anything good. Number 8. Parrot Horn. And what do you get when you cross a flower horn with a parrot cichlid? A parrot horn of course. Some say that flower horns and parrot cichlids are sterile, 
so the origins of this fish are not quite known. They could in theory have just produced this parrot cichlid looking fish with the flower horn pattern just by selecting successive generations of deformed flower horns, but either way, of interest to the minority of fish keepers but horrific to most of those who appreciate cichlids in their natural form. Number 9. Balloon Fish. The breeding of shortened bodies in ornamental fish is actually quite common. Fancy goldfish were first of course, though some seem less shocking because they have always been that way throughout living memory. But take a tropical fish that we like and appreciate in its natural form like the ram or this pearl gourami for example and it looks pretty shocking. Balloon fish are missing vertebrae so are at a skeletal disadvantage when compared to their more able-bodied tank mates. Number 10. Dyed Glassfish. One of the first artificial tropical fish to cause genuine outcry in the aquatic community, and one that PFK launched its well-known anti-dyed fish campaign off the back of. Glassfish were the first victims of being injected with dye via a needle, but since then we have seen Corydoras, loaches, and black widow tetras, let alone the poor old parrot cichlid once again. PFK investigated this practice while in Singapore in 2007 and no matter what dodgy retailers may tell you, every one of those poor fish has been handled, and injected with dye, some with two colors. What's more, the glassfish isn't a hardy aquarium fish at the best of times, and dyed specimens quickly succumb to white spot. Or lymphocystis. We are fish lover. And we love to keeping fish hobby. So avoid this types of fish. And stay safe and stay healthy fish keeping. Thank you so much for watching Fish Lover. Keep like and subscribe to our channel for more upcoming video BB Fish Lover. Thank you so much for watching my video. And comment what is your opinion about this video.